five main reasons why you keep getting injured and you never seem to fix it. And it has nothing to do with how strong your glutes are, how flexible you are, or whether your shoes have done 300 miles or 3,000 miles. Reason number one, you keep on doing too much too soon. Running is really hard on your body. You might have noticed that. Reason number two, Stop stretching. Now, apart from the fact that many of your muscles biomechanically can't be stretched, there is no actual reason that you need to be flexible to run. Remember, endurance running creates weakness. So what we don't want to do is go stretching muscles which actually causes weakness on top of muscles that have been weakened by running. Reason number three, your posture sucks. Reason number four, one of the reasons why you should absolutely have a full body swing method gait analysis is because we look at every single joint in the body to see how it moves, how it acts, how it functions with each other joint when you run. Damn you previous injuries. Reason number five. Now I hate to break it to you, but your personal trainer and your physical therapist might not know this, but all those strength exercises you're doing, they're pretty much a waste of time. Now, as we know, strength is specific to the movement. Now, the truth is, if you can sprint, you're already strong enough to run slower. And endurance running, even more than anything else, has nothing to do with strength. It's all to do with drumroll endurance. Anything that involves the same movement thousands of times over and over again without rest has nothing to do with strength. Now, if an exercise that you're doing doesn't even look remotely like the action of running, then the chances are it's not run specific. You don't have to be specific when you're strength training. It's about strength. But strength is specific, right? And the research does show this. But, 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 but nothing. Most of the stuff you'll see online is general, unspecific, arbitrary. And to be quite honest with you, it's one of the reasons why you're still getting injured. Because think about it. If your strength training isn't strengthening the things that need strengthening, then it's not strength training for running, right?